Hello all. Uh, this one's going to be on colorizing the uh, color, uh, the bus script, uh, the command prompt in Arch Linux. And this is uh, going through the wiki. Um, what I finally ended up doing was making a script to uh, copy all this stuff over. So I'll leave that um, in the description as to where you can uh, read through this and as to where you get the file. So I'll open uh, wherever you downloaded it to. There's a downloads folder, for example, and it's bash colors. There's a tar gz file. So I'll just uh, select extract here, for example, and press control H to unhide everything. Uh, this is the modified bash colors uh, and uh, other variations. And the script is uh, to enable it as, bash, as the colors.sh. If you have open terminal here, you can do that and make it easier, or just uh, go to the path, wherever it's extracted. You can do an ls-a, you see all the files. Uh, what I suggest, though, uh, to make this work is just uh, super user root terminal, and do an ls, and you want to run colors.sh, so I'll copy that, and put a dot, slash, control, uh, shift V or just paste that in with right click mouse and press enter. You won't see anything until you exit the terminal. And then uh, open control T in my case and you can see it's colorized now. It also has other functions uh, such as checking the mirror and uh, checking for updates. So it'll be instead of sudo pacman dash S capital S Y Y it's just pac U. And if you have your uh, sudo uh, set up as no password, you won't even have to type in the password. So obviously there's nothing there. You want to search for something that's P-A-C-S um, FF MPEG. It'll come back and give you all the uh, FF MPEG results. And if you want to just download it, it's just the word pack FF MPEG. Oops. MPEG. Make sure I spell that right. And there's the files. It tells you how much, of course. And no. When I select no, I get a sad face <laughs> at the bottom. Okay? Uh, you Just uh, right-click and, you know, open them with uh, whatever you have, like LeafPad. It's just very, very basic script. It's just because I get sick of having to set it up all the time. If you want to remove it, um, this will copy your Bash RC that you've made a backup of back to the original. So again, open terminal and super user ls and just uh, double click, remove colors, copy and a dot slash, and there we go. Paste that in. Enter. Exit. Exit. Terminal, and we're back to the regular terminal. Okay. So. Read through the wiki on that. Uh, you can experiment with your own colors or whatever. You can add stuff uh, to this bash RC file. Here it is here. You can look through it. It's the same thing that's on the uh, the website. Okay? So I'll put this uh, up a uh, couple of mirrors so you can download the file if you wish. And try it out if you want to add something to it or anything or have any suggestions. Feel free to add. And that should take care of that. So... Thank you so much for watching, and we'll talk to you soon. And bye for now.